Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick, and today they released new content, uh, the NFL Draft content. Uh, each Thursday, they're going to be releasing a new player. Starting out this week, it was Patrick Peterson, and they're going to be releasing collections such as this. First, you're going to want to get the workout Peterson done. Uh, there is five silver collectibles plus the 80 overall combine. Patrick Peterson, which is worth about 4k. I think it costs about 20-ish k to finish this. Uh, I'll take a look at the price of the collectibles in this video. But I just bought a Patrick Peterson for 4k just to, I don't know, have him. And then you have the choice. Once you complete that, you get a gold uh, Patrick Peterson item. Untradeable and unauctionable. And then you can do either of these collections. Either this one that's plus 2 to speed and plus 2 to press. Or this one that's plus 2 agility and plus 2 to man coverage. They really needed to give you something other than agility. Because this one's just a heck of a lot better. Um, but that's just my opinion. But There is the gold one right there. He's an 88 overall. And then you have 6 gold collectible combine cards. And I think that costs like 300,000 to complete. Um, and then you get a 98 overall Patrick Peterson. But just a little overview. I'll show you uh, the card. Even though I'll show you to you on the auction, but let's see. I will have a new update or a lineup update coming up. Uh, just going over, I bought a bunch of cards out as I had 600k in an earlier video, and I'm down to 466. Uh, so, also have uh, Justin Houston on the auction, so I really have like 490. Uh, so, there are his stats, pretty good. Uh, if you just kind of flip this over. Look at those stats. It's pretty darn close. His speed is ass cheeks Magoo on this one, but uh, he's not that bad of a card. But I do have one thing while I'm getting ready, while I'm searching up these. I want to know your guys' opinion. Should I get Randy Moss, the uh, uh, all Madden 25, the 99 overall one, and Isaac Bruce, or should I get uh, just Sean Taylor? Uh, I'd like to know your guys' opinion. I'm going to get one or the other. Uh, I have some pretty good wide receivers, uh, but I have a decent safety and on roll. role. So you can see Peterson tackle. Um, I'm just going to round up to 3,500. So that's 7K, 11, 11, uh, 16. There's one more, isn't there? Which one am I missing? Agility. Is there like one that's super expensive? I probably missed it. Is there one that's like price? Oh, speed. Of course speed would be expensive. Okay, so. What was I at? Like 15? And then you got to factor in speed that's 30k. So it's 45 to get the initial one. And then, let's see here, 9, 21, 21, 41, 41, okay, gotta make sure, 41, 70, 100, I'm missing gold speed and something else. Elusiveness, I think. Was that 70? 105? Why is speed so expensive? In a collectible, why? So, to like 200k, I think? So, 200... It's like... Is that really it? I feel like it'd be more than that, because... He... Is... Way more than that. But uh, there are his initial ones, 4K, as you can see. Plenty of them up, so if you need one, you can pick them up. But the real thing, the real prize, is the 98 overall. Uh, you can see, let's see here, there are seven on the auction, and I think six of them are the man defense. There is the speed and press, yeah. Most people want that speed and press. And 324,000 is not that bad, but. I don't really want to spend it on him at the moment. I'll pick him up later because he'll keep dropping, I think, because it's not that hard of a collection to do. But I really wish they would have done um, 
like last year and what you want to call it, and uh, have like a cool collection. No Leon Sandcastle, but a cool collection like they did last year. Because if you played last year, you remember the excitement you got when you pulled a Vernon Davis or a Dwight Freeney. That stuff was just crazy. Or when you pulled a Tebow, it was even fine because he discarded for 10k. But everything else was like 20 to 50k. And then you had those that were like 400k each for the longest time. And then they dropped, but Vernon Davis was still worth 400k. And you could do it on farm accounts. And it was like 50k each time. And then the Leon Sandcastle sold for like 60k minimum. It was it was the good days. That was the good days because the collection also gave you like 14 legendary packs and like... I think it was like 100k or something like that. Those were the good days. Not this where you can't gain a single coin. But yeah, that's going to do it for this video. I'm cutting it short because it's 12.15 in the morning and I want to get this up before I go to sleep around 2 or 3. So, hope you guys enjoyed. Drop a like if you did. Subscribe if you haven't. And I will have another video up with a collection. Another video up with my lineup. So I'll probably do the collection tomorrow and the lineup on Saturday. So yeah, and no, 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 no. Probably do football outsiders tomorrow. Um, legendary cards on Saturday, collection Sunday, team update Monday. Maybe I don't know. Probably won't end up like that. But I'll catch you guys later. Peace out.